Hello, welcome to Maker's technical support video series, Frequently Asked Questions. In this video, we will discuss how to live stream data from an S1 insulation resistance tester. Let's get started. To live stream data from a test on an S1 insulation tester, let's connect to it using PowerDB. We, work, we will use serial port number 8. We can go to the device manager if we have any question on which uh, serial port we are using. In this case, we'll go to uh, COM ports on the device manager and we can see it there as a mega device, COM8. That's the unit that we have connected. So we click here, OK. Now we select an insulation resistance test and um, down here we click, left click, on uh, any of these buttons. This will bring this uh, dialog here uh, where we have the option to remote control the unit, import data, or do a live stream. So now we are going to select live stream. This shows this uh, screen which gives us instructions on what to do. Use this tile to select the type of test. Insulation resistance over time in this case. Use this one to select the test voltage and click on the test button until the test uh, uh, begins. When the test begins, we uh, immediately see data showing up on the screen, uh, both on the graph and on the um, table on top. When um, the data shows up, we have the option of uh, showing the data in either um, the uh, X axis can be selected as uh, time and uh, we can choose uh, what do we want to show on the Y. For example, here we are uh, showing resistance, uh, whereas before we were showing um, current or we can show, for example, the voltage to check how stable the voltage is during the test. In this case, it's 500 volts all along. I choose to show it as um, current, like as I can see um, right here. After a while, I can give it some uh, some time. I can just uh, stop the live stream, and uh, when I do that, I have to select this uh, button that says "Save Select to Form," which will bring the data into the the form. Once we have the data in the in the form, we can see all of it. And uh, we can also see a graph that shows the evolution of the uh, test that we just performed. This concludes how to live stream data from an S1 insulation resistance tester. Visit the Mega YouTube channel for more videos including technical webinars, product overviews and other how-to presentations similar to this one. Contact us for questions or more information about this topic or for any support you may need for your electrical testing.